this bag here. I am not going to use them yet. I wanted these because they were pretty and I love the sound they make. Look at that. Maybe I'll do some proper ASMR with them um, with my other mic setup. But these are runes and I love them so much. I just wish, I hope that one day, maybe in a few years time, Maybe I will learn how to read them, how to use them, but um, yeah, we've got, it's a whole bag of runes and they are just beautiful. See, look at all the... Hello there, and thank you so much for joining me today. As some of you know, I don't consider myself witchy. Um, but I have been drawn more and more to that side of things in my old age and I've always considered myself a little bit in touch with nature and my first ever, my main character on World of Warcraft is a druid and I just, I just love the feel of just connecting with nature so that that really speaks to me and I want to explore that more and more and I have stumbled upon some some online shops that that have caught my eye and I very much want to to look at rocks and minerals and gemstones because it was something that was a part of my youth um, with my grandmother and I've talked about that in, in other videos. And so I had a, a shop recommended to me. This is not sponsored at all. I've paid full price for everything. I just wanted to share some of my goodies with you, essentially. Uh, I don't, hope you don't mind me doing that. So this is the Crystal Witch, uh, which was uh, a recommendation through my Twitch community. And... I've bought a few things from the Crystal Witch now and I'm very very happy with my purchases. This video is going to cover some intentional purchases. So that is to say things that I saw and I had little grabby hands and had to have them. And there are, yeah, there are a few reasons why I wanted some of these things. And I have another video up my sleeve because for my birthday, I indulged a little. I bought a hundred pound mystery box or mystery collection and I want to share with you what is in my mystery hundred pounds collection, which was also from the Crystal Witch. So, today we will cover a few little bits that I just dipped in and nibbled at and then yeah, watch this space for, for more vids on, on similar topics, okay? Right, also I do want to just make it clear this is a learning curve for me. So I do not know all of the rocks and minerals and gems off the top of my head. I'm still learning and I'm really honestly enjoying that journey. So come with me and let's, let's have a little rummage in my box, shall we? Oh, there you are. Hello, hello. Okay, so yes, this is the Crystal Witch. And um, I, yeah, this box contains a bunch of items that I, I have picked up my last two purchases with, with them. So, let's see what we have. One thing that I love about shopping with the Crystal Witch is that she includes little cards which tell you about your purchases and if you get a mystery box she will include a card for everything that's in the box so even if you can't identify it it might take you a while but by a process of elimination you should be able to work out what is what so I, I, I just, I find that ever so helpful. It is so useful. I'll give you um, 
I'll give you an example in a moment. So let's have a look. Um, so I did buy two little bags. Now these little bags are just to support. Um, one is anxiety and one is sleep. Both of those things are very dear to me. I would love to have better, more restful sleep. And I, I just happen to suffer from social anxiety. I rarely leave my flat. So I wanted, uh, I wanted to grab these two. I think, I think they're about eight pounds each. Now there is some overlap. Now, yes, there there is some overlap in the stones, and that's because the stones properties um, apply to both scenarios. So we have one for sleep, and that contains amethyst, smoky quartz, rose quartz, and obsidian. And I have a little bag for anxiety that also contains amethyst. It contains clear quartz. We have some more rose quartz, and we have howlite. I my collection was not large to start off with, so I didn't actually have any howlite. So I'm quite quite happy to have some howlite now. So should we take a little look at? Um, Now here they are, so pretty, so pretty. So these are relatively straightforward to, um, to identify, I think, she says. So this should be my obsidian. I'm gonna hold that in front of me here. So yes, this should be my obsidian. And obviously this one is my rose quartz. The lighting's not great which is a shame um maybe for the next video i will try to improve my lighting i do do have a light here but i worry that it's just going to to mess things up a bit see i feel like is that a bit too bright you, you still can't see the colors it's just now everything is very reflected but here oh i guess that's nice because you can see this is the smoky quartz. I guess if I hold them here, you can see this is quite, it's cloudy. Um, as you kind of expect, but that is beautiful. And then... This... This is amethyst, but... I don't know, could that be... Could that be chevron amethyst? It looks... Or is it just... I don't know. There seems to be some sort of... Some sort of banding effect here, and I, I quite like that. So, this, this little collection will support sleep. And, um, yeah, I'm going to be popping that in my bedroom. So, um, amethyst is to support sleep, dreams, and calm. We have the smoky quartz, which is for protection, a grounding and balance. The rose quartz is self-love, empathy and relaxation. And our obsidian, this is for confidence, inner strength and channeling. So, I love these. Going to pop them back in the bag. Love the sound they make as the, the tumble stones just bonk and bop against each other. So I'm going to pop that there. Then these are my stones for anxiety. As I said, there is a little bit of overlap, but I don't mind. 
So we have the rose quartz. Oh, surely that, surely that. I mean, that is literally a chevron, right? Is that a piece of chevron amethyst? Please tell me if you happen to know these things. As I said, I am very much a baby in this sort of stuff, but I would, I'm interested to know, because look at that. It's just so beautiful. I love it. I've said in videos before, my grandmother always used to have amethyst above the fireplace on the mantelpiece and it made me so happy. Um, just amethyst reminds me of my grandmother and it's a lovely, lovely memory. Um, so this is our clear quartz and then this is our howlite, right? So we've, we've covered the amethyst and the rose quartz earlier. The clear quartz is for anxiety, protection and meditation. And how light is for confidence, inner strength and channeling. I think there is some great potential combinations. So this is my anxiety bundle. And if I do ever leave the flat, I think I might take those out with me just to keep them on my person. And just see, see how, see how I feel. They're nice just to hold and just to play with anyway. So those are my two little, little bundles. And I want to share some other bits that I've got. Let me reach into my box. Okay, so, ah, yes. This, this is a piece of selenite. I can't remember, I think it has another name um, because it's this particular type of selenite, but I love it. I love the feel. It feels exactly as it looks. Honestly, it's just, uh, it looks so so crunchy. I love the elegance. Just, it's just, it's just so different. It's, um, yeah. So I do have a card for this one as well. Let me grab that. So selenite is for and I don't know if you can see this, I'll read it out. Cleansing, purification, and clearing. Um, chakras, it's uh, etheric, crown, third eye. The planet it's associated with is the moon. And the zodiac signs are Gemini and Cancer. That's a lovely little piece of selenite. So I, I wanted to indulge and get one of those. Very happy with that. I can't remember how much it is. Next up, we have. Oh, okay. So, remember how I said I'm not at all witchy, but I have been drawn to some items? The next is a wand, and I'm not going to be using it as a wand. I just felt like I needed needed this. It was the last one that they had at the time in the shop and I, yeah, I wanted this. So this is the end and I think the reason I wanted it is because this is carnelian and I happen to know that because I'm a Leo, carnelian is, I believe, a gemstone for Leos. So let me just check. See, now the light is kind of, I feel like the light has ruined my little display. But you can't see everything as well. So, um, here we have Carnelian. Carnelian is for motivation, courage, and manifestation. The chakras, you have the solar plexus, the sacral, and the root. 
the planets that it is linked with Mars and the Sun. And the zodiac signs are Taurus, Cancer, Leo and Virgo. So, I'm going to try popping this light back, see if things level out a bit. just seems very shadowy. We don't like the shadows. Not, not when we're looking at uh, pretty stones. Okay, so I'm going to pop that down here. Put my carnelian card here. Now, what else do we have? Actually, <laughs> me trying to remember all the lovely things that I've bought. Oh, okay. Okay, so... This one. This is a dragon egg. And this is um, Lepidolite. Now, I bought this because I love the colour purple. And I just, it's so pretty. But I don't think you can really see it, which is a shame. Now, this isn't going to glow, but I wonder if I can help you see. It's got these tiny little sparkles on it. Um, no, I can't really see those, which is a shame. But my dragon's egg has this, it's like, like silica maybe on the outside, the little sparkles. Oh, you can, you can just about see a little bit of a sparkle. Um, I wonder if we can do it better on this camera in front of me. Hello, here is my nose. Here is. <laughs> um, not that great. Anyway, uh, yeah, so it's got this beautiful purpleness, and I love, love purple, and it's got this little sparkly outside, which, yeah, I don't know why it's called a dragon's egg, but, um, I might, I might read up on that. So, this, this is very, very pretty. I kind of also wanted to have an example of lepidolite, because, because it's purple and I don't want to get confused between it and amethyst, so I wanted to be able to compare the pieces so that I could say, okay, this feels like an amethyst and this feels like a lepidolite. So let's pop that here and I'm going to read about it. So lepidolite is for anxiety relief, self-expression and dreams. The chakra is the third eye and the crown. Planets are Jupiter and Neptune. And Zodiac is Libra and Pisces. So I'll pop that here. Okay. I think I have two more things to show you. Okay, one of the things... I really wish I'd had my other mic set up. I have one other mic set up which is quite new. And that has two microphones. And... This would be great. So this, this bag here, I am not going to use them yet. I wanted these because they were pretty and I love the sound they make. That. Maybe I'll do some proper ASMR with them, um, with my other mic set up. But these are runes and I love them so much. I just wish, I hope that one day, maybe in a few years time, maybe I will learn how to read them, how to use them. But um, yeah, we've got, it's a whole bag of runes and they are just beautiful. See, look at all the, look, look, look. This is just some of them. So these are on clear quartz. I think they do have some with, it's either rose quartz or a smoky quartz. So I think they do have one set on the shop at the moment. I'll pop that back here. And clear quartz, that is for, um, it is a master healer. It is for protection and meditation. The chakras are etheric, all your major chakras and earth star. Planet, it's this is seems like a very all encompassing uh, stone, um, all celestial bodies, and all zodiac signs. 
so. I guess worth having a decent piece of clear quartz in your collection. Maybe I do have one. Maybe I have one not too far away from me. And the last piece that I want to show you is going to sit right on here. It is a piece of feather fluorite and this does not do it justice. Um, it is beautiful so you're probably seeing something quite bluey but it's definitely see here okay here you can see the greeniness look at that and there's this the kind of band no tree there's a band down here you can see like a, a purple purplish band you can see all those different hues i saw this piece see i was a little bit a little bit cheeky what happened was i ordered the mystery um mystery mix that i talked about earlier and and they messaged me and said look do you mind if we delay your order by a couple of days because we have some new stuff coming in and we'd like to be able to select from that for your mystery mix and of course i was more than happy it was excellent communication and that said to me that the new stuff was coming in so i just kept refreshing the shop to look for new arrivals and this was one of the new arrivals and i saw it and i just thought this needs to be mine oh yes it will be mine and there was only one of these available and it's just just so beautiful so there are actually a bunch of other really lovely lovely spheres and things that i would like to get my hands on but i got to pace myself um, but this is beautiful so yes you can kind of kind of see the the floweriness or the featheriness i mean sorry um, but it's a beautiful piece and i just have a soft spot for fluorite i really like fluorite i think it's because it's pretty it glows in the dark i just i do you know, i actually have a soft spot for quite a few different different stones so that yeah you can see that this this camera does not do it justice and for the mystery box i will try to work out a better better lighting scenario and i think um, so let me read to you a little bit about fluorite. So fluorite is for rejuvenation and healing and peace. It's all major chakras. Your planet is Mercury and it is for Libra, Capricorn and Pisces. But I just, it makes me so happy. So I hope you don't mind me taking some of your time up to talk about these i have i've just i i am very much enjoying this journey and i hope hope you don't mind me sharing that with you come back with me so i am going to head off now but i want to wish you a delightful day a wonderful week and the snuggliest of sleeps when it is time to go to bed. Take care. You are very special.